Welcome back to episode 82. We're I'm in... Sean, this is Gus, and this is oh, Earthbound. Yes, it's definitely Gus and Sean, your, your friends that have been playing this game the whole time. That's true. And Nonet has definitely always looked gray and terrifying. Just it's kidding, I'm like, Kamikaze, and this is... Butterfly in <coughs> the sky. LeVar Burton. <laughs> but this is episode 82, not 81. I was silly. I haven't watched, but like, apparently LeVar Burton has been campaigning to host Jeopardy for a long time, and like, they finally gave him a shot at doing it. Well, apparently he's great at and it, and everybody great. loves him. I'm not surprised, of course. It, it just feels right, you know? It, yeah, I don't know why, but it does. It's because we grew up with him. He's, like, for he's, an intellectual he's an, he's thing. An American so you gotta go up to. Oh, oh, oh. Those are scary. Those are scary shapes. Floating sideways hell. Rubik's Cubes. You gotta go up the hill. We could go to our actual house, but it really Yeah, go here. in your house, man. Put away some stuff. That's the rich kid's house. It's Master Pokey's house. Master Pokey's his name. Well, it's just funny you're calling him that. This? Oh, God. Well, that makes sense. You got Squidward and that other guy. Mechanical Octobot. Okay. You know, this reminds me of a lot of the new season of American Horror Story. <laughs> No, it doesn't. <laughs> it's a sea monster. Who? The one on the left is Squidward. Oh. Uh, it's so... But yeah, so we were talking about off camera that the new season of American Horror Story is a double feature. Featuring what looks to be a sea monster. Oh, crap. These guys can diamondize you. That's not good at all. You can always heal that. But a sea monster making out with an alien. So I was like, I don't know what that is. But I only brought it up because did you ever hear of American Horror Stories? With an S? Wait, isn't that the same thing? I don't nope. understand. So, uh, the creator of that show signed a deal with Hulu for one off episodes. Real good. Like, uh, episodes that don't have anything to do with the actual series as a whole. They can relate back to it, but they're just one offs. So, the first episode was about the very first season. The second one was really cool. It was about like a, a drive-in theater with a cursed movie. It made people go insane. The but the one I really wanted to tell you about was the one with Santa Claus. Uh, okay, I'm in. I knew you would be. I I just need to figure out what which your powers <clears throat> can fix this. Uh, that one. It's the expensive one. Okay. It's the, the sexy one. Very sexy feeling item. Because diamonds are a girl's best friend, and thus Paula is a diamond. Because you are what you eat. I don't like this. Okay. I anyway. Guess we have to go You're going to tell me about Santa Claus. Yes. So it opens with. Um, oh. oh, wow. Ghost, the ghost of Star, is Star Man. Man. That's way cooler. <laughs> uh. Wow. But yeah, they, they open with like some like douchey reality show style opening. Like it's a bunch of dudes in like a like a house. They're just like internet celebrities and they're being like a-holes. Basically, quote unquote, being naughty. You know what I'm saying? See where I'm going with this? Okay. And they go to the mall and like torment like the elves and try to torment Santa Claus. And he's like, you'll be punished. And they're like, what? So they leave. And they find out that, spoilers for anybody who hasn't seen it, but this will probably be months in advance, but that's on you. Just skip ahead, like, five minutes. Oh, dear. But, um, they find out that wasn't the Santa Claus that was supposed to be at the mall, and it was a guy that murdered the Santa Claus that was supposed to be in the mall. Santa murder. And he was, like, the pagan embodiment of the version of Santa Claus that kills people who are bad. Wait, what? Yeah, and the best part what? is he's played by Danny Trejo. What? So awesome. Um, it's the most graphic I and gruesome really like thing. I really 40% of this, and I really dislike... 60% of it. Well, 40% of it. 20% of it is like, what? What? You should see when he snaps a dude's neck. It's crazy. Crazy. They did special effects so it looked like his spine popped out. I was like, whoa. Felt really gross. That's how you know they did a good job. When you feel super gross about something you just watched. 
<laughs> yeah, I guess that's and then true. the most recent one was about the pagan god of fertility turning out to be like a pagan demon of fertility and trying to take this chick's baby. Okay. Each one is a one-off, which I like because I don't believe that Ryan Murphy can write a full season of television successfully. He always kind of meanders, you know? Like, he doesn't have good endings to his seasons of, like, Glee or American Horror Story or Scream Queens yes. or... They all just sort of peter out. But I like the idea of him having, like, a one-off Twilight Zone-style version of his show. Because I like the concepts for his show, but he needs to follow through. I don't know if half of his writing team always quits halfway through or what's going on, but... Um, I, he probably just hires different people for every story. No, but I'm saying every season of every show he's ever written peters out right at the end. Like, there's not a solid yeah. ending. Like, it starts really strong, and then it's just like, why am I still watching this? Which is really sad, because I really like his concepts. That's fine. I'm sure when he sees this episode of Earthbound, he's gonna be, like, fuming. It's Fish fine. You. Just just hire me, dude. I got you. These guys are tough. Okay. Mechanical Octobot and Squidward. Okay. And Squidward! Should we use this? Do it. Blow him up. You got it lots and lots so and lots wasteful. of magic, though. You got footing all day. Just do it. That is true. We do have more PP Veritable than literally anyone else footing, has yes. health, which is kind of offensive, really. Limitless pudding. I, I also don't know how much damage you're supposed to do to like, normal people. Do you... Have you ever... Have you made a milkshake on your own? Alright. Follow question, since that is a no. Don't have you ever made a milkshake using pudding mix? Also no. Makes it work. way it work? creamier. Because you don't let it set, so it's just really thick and rich. Okay. So, the thing I figured out is you gotta buy those, uh, you know when we were kids and they would make like mud and they'd have like gummy earthworms and the crumbs that are Oreos? You buy those, you pour the mix in the blender with the ice cream, and then you top it with the, like the dirt, the Oreo crumbs. And then you just have a bag of gummy worms for later. But it's an incredible milkshake. <laughs> I guarantee that it is way more calories than any one person should be ingesting at any point in their life, but you will sleep very well afterward. <laughs> After the sugar wears off and the lethargic energy leaves your body. Or lack of oh yeah, did we ever do That's that? That's the guy who has the devil in his basement. We we beat that, right? That wasn't like a side quest. All we had to do was get to here. It's gonna attack you. I can feel it. <laughs> <laughs> do it. It's a bad idea. We're gonna get attacked. We got the oh. It was that easy. Oh, you know what? I bet we're gonna hand this to his dad, and he's going to go insane. I think we, we have to defeat him. You can try. I do love me some meteorite. You hit the meteorite. Unbelievable. Okay. You, you were like one pixel off, dude. Well, they did this on purpose. Okay. Not if you stand on the meteorite. What if I go right here? Is Feel that room funky Dixieland, come on. Some, some, take me by the hand. Alright, we're gonna try to do it here because I really don't want to fight more baddies. You're gonna hit the, we're gonna hit the uh, right. The little edge on the right there. Woo! Alright. Yeehaw, you know what I'm saying? Go give it to your father, dude. Oh, you're gonna take a nappy? We're gonna slumber. I want slumber. A little nappy pie. Bird's bad. <laughs> oh, those are nice morning birds. No, you're right. Get them out of here. Um, Where's my gun? I thought I had a piece of a meteorite. There's no breeding here. Okay. Is, really Is that how it works? Do you just, like, go to it and click use or something? Who has it? Who has it? Poo! Ah, ah yes. yes. This is fantastic. Oh. So he doesn't know what he's doing. Get some rest. This is gonna get most fascinating. 
Uh, I have a feeling he goes insane. I think I spoiled something for myself. You can't sp Your theories are not cell spoilers. No, but, like, I thought I saw, like, a crazy version of him online or something. And I thought, oh, that's kind of a weird thing to fan art, you know? I so, know. there's a possibility that he's going to beat us to death or something. We will find out right now. That'd be really cool if we had to kill our own dad. It, th this is, I don't think this is just yet. Phase Distorted Version 2. It is equipped with two new features. First, it won't explode. Oh, it can heal you, and it can save. Wow, that's awesome. You might not be able to return, so make sure you're optimally outfitted. Oh, jeez. Uh... Say no. <laughs> because we're about to fight the boss of the game, you can tell. So is there anything you want to do? Um... Hmm. So... Is there anything you read online? Is there any research that you have whimsied? I haven't really thought past this point yet. One thing that I can think of is, um... I think there's one other item for Pudu that we can get that we haven't gotten yet. I, don't, I think we've given up his weapon, because it's like a 1-128 one, one, one chance that one of the star men will drop it. Yeah, we we're not bothering that. with that. We're not gonna so farm I didn't that. feel like grinding through that. I think the um, the body item is still up for grabs, and I think it's in the swamp somewhere. Oh, jeez. Aw, oh, shucks. But I would have to look that up. That's fine. I'll riff. Hello, all. Well, you... Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Here, I'll just do random crap. Gotta make it visually interesting. Okay, poo. Think items. I can... Oh, look. It's a conga line going wrong. Well, I should have been more specific when I googled that. This is how the teleport should work. Look at this. This is a hot mess. This is probably closer to what an orgy looks like. Look at this. Cloak of Kings. Woof. Woof. Look at this. Woof. Oh, it's in the Lost Underworld. Look at this. Woof. Sorry, right, ready? Oh, Woof. they're children. Come on. They're 40. Right. Sh show me again what items um, Pooh has equipped. Who? Pooh. Pooh. Blues clues. Oh, I do that. <laughs> this is this is why you don't drive. Um, well, I barely left. I barely played this game with I, you. Yeah, that's true. He has the Bracer Kings and the Diet of Kings. It's very bold to assume okay. he's a king. He's a child, after all. I don't think he is actually a king. He's just an a hole. Look at me run in a figure eight, it's very distracting. Okay, how do we get to the Lost Underworld? Uh, I don't know, that's kind of why it's lost, dude. <laughs> 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 Did you look it up? I, uh, well, can we teleport there? I don't know. Did or do we, you have to go all the way through go there everything? Already? It's just, it's such an absolute blur that... Okay. Underworld. Yeah. Is that the lost underworld, though? Yeah. You sure? It's, it's, the, it's the last thing. It's after Tender Village. After the dead. Oh, we're in the, in the volcano. We just missed it, whatever it is. Here you go. It's the thing that gets you to the volcano. Okay. Um, no, no, no. no, hold on. Oh, oh no, no! <laughs> nice going. It spawned me in the dinosaur. <laughs> uh, well, now you have to fight this thing. <sighs> D-I-N-O-S-A, you are a dinosaur. An O L D M A N. You're just an old man. Hitting on me, what? You need a CAT scan. Anyway, uh. hey dinosaur. Oh, throw on the big guns. Dude, he almost killed Paula in one shot. Oh, right, these guys that. have Mondo in that car. Okay. Goodbye, wow. Paula. <laughs> that. I forgot how dangerous this place is. I thought that after <laughs> Ness's gauntlet that we're just invincible. Oh good, he just magically has a shield too. Uh, yeah, you gotta use the bazooka. Well this sucks ass. Oh, his shield disappeared there. Oh, this is not good. <laughs> oh yeah, Ness is like immune to fire for some reason. He has a pendant on, yeah. Oh, is that what, why Paula was immune the whole time too? Probably, I forget what she has. Since we're gonna have to go heal, I'm just gonna explode. Do it. Wait, have. Um... I don't care. He'll be dead in a second. Woo! A mass extinction event. 
Uh, that was a great fight. We did wonderful. Well, this... Okay. How um, about we go to this Jurassic Park area? Okay. Yeah, do that. Oh, right. The water thing. How do we heal? Okay. Strange words like, hello, click, click, beep. <laughs> I think that bird is It a is phone. a bird. It's a phone. After an earthquake, hot springs rubbed down the ground. Have you ever noticed that? Blue springs are great for rubbing down the sweet pod. Okay, I know where to go. Go up and to the left. Okay, we're gonna go down and to the right. No. Where's the hot spring? That's what I'm looking for. Do you know? Um... No, but it doesn't matter. It does, because I'm going to heal. I think you should just try to avoid those guys. Hold up, brah. Feel that funky Dixie land. Come on home. Okay. Take and take me by the hand. Well, you might need to heal Jeff too, right? No! But... No, no, no! Oh! <laughs> I was trying to squeeze those trees. Um, no, go go down. Uh, why? And, uh... Do I have to? You might be able to... I think you can heal in the town. So you should... You see me there. walk through that squiggle right there? They had no idea what hit him. Oh, this is one of the things. Yeah, I'm gonna go to that instead. It's safer. I don't know what that guy is. Look at how good I am at being pixels. <laughs> I, I love the idea of a giant level. It's, it's so much fun. Is, is it? Is it? Is it gonna? Is it gonna pop off? Oh, there we go. <laughs> Yay, lava! Oh, that's a red one. That, that means it's good. That means it restores your PP. Oh, it says treaty completely. What does that do? Uh, really? Uh. I didn't do anything. It, it, no, so the red ones are curing status ailments. Oh, like status ailments. Poisons and... Okay. Well, Which... I'm going to go explode that dinosaur with everything I've got and just walk into the town and heal. Yeah, I think that might have to happen. Feel that funky Dixie land. Uh... You ever seen Barney die? Because he's about to. This is the closest thing to Barney in this game, probably. Wait, does he start with that shield or is this going to kill you if you do this? I don't care. <laughs> Wait, Jeff has the goods. He does. And Pooh has. He has Star Storm, I guess. The mass extinction event. How does Paul outspeed Ness? Uh, it's not good enough. I want the most damage imaginable. This really might be overkill. I know. <laughs> oh, actually, I didn't do that much. Holy crap, he lived? Dude, he's not dying. Why did that work? The big barn, he's not going down, yo. You shouldn't need a sheep uh, make him again. But... You're right. <laughs> well, you should just be... This is just... Uh. You're right. Oh, you make me so uncomfortable the way you do this. <laughs> Uh, well, I guess you are done researching. You can play again, but like, this is funny. Yeah, no, it totally is. Uh, Here we go. I, I should tell you long tales about Tell me the difference between concrete and cement. That'll be interesting. Cement is a constituent of concrete. Oh, so it voted for the other? Um, <laughs> never mind. We stopped that, the lesson there. <laughs> but, you didn't like that? I thought that was pretty pretty quick. Hey, didn't you think that something, something, something? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Which one heals you? This one? Maybe. Man, you are no help. You're the, the god of this game. You know what? Fine, I'm leaving. Going down. No, right. no, no, go back in there. Hold on, hold on. What are you doing? If I remember correctly, there's a fountain over here. I could be wrong. This could be death. We, you've gone, okay. Well, we're going back. <laughs> go, Pixels, go. This is all, all we had to do. Go, Pixels, go. It's so much more terrifying when we're Pixels. Okay. Hello. Oh, I was trying to say no. 
Do you shut up? God, it's probably the first one on the left. I'm working the, on it, man. Entrance. Wow, that's kind of racist. Really? This is the ATM. Oh, absolutely not. We're not paying this person any more money. But it'd be awesome. Can we teleport out of here? And what does that look like? You definitely can, but um, it's really small. It really was the first like person, wasn't it? Yeah. It's, this game isn't that hard. Dun, 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 dun. Okay. And with that sweet little nap, we'll talk to you guys next time. Okay. Yeah. This fuck, is stressing me out. Fuck the dinosaur, dude. <laughs> um, Look at that a-hole. We're gonna have to deal with him. Anyway, goodbye. I like that he pauses during the earthquake. You scared. <laughs>